Hey guys, so today I'm back with another video and today is going to be my Ipsy unbagging for July. Um, I know I missed, this is my first one back in a few months because I had been skipping Ipsy and you know, um, I just felt like I had too many samples already and I wanted to use them up first before I got more. So I cancelled my, I didn't cancel it, I just paused my subscription and this month is my first month back. So it's a cute one. So. I'm excited to see what I got. Um, but yeah, if you want to see what I got, just keep on watching. So this is what the bag looks like. It's like blue holographic and the little Ipsy logo right here. So I already know what I got because they send you like spoiler alerts and stuff. So this is the first thing. It's it's a 10 Miracle Leaving Light sample. Looks like that. So it says it's a shampoo... Amazing. It's amazingly easy to use. Shampoo and conditioned hair towel dry spray product all over hair and come through. So, um, yeah, it's just a kind of like a leave-in conditioner in a way or mask or something like that. So, that's cool. I think I've seen this brand before, but I'm not sure. I'm excited I got it, though. And I don't have my whole face because I'll be using the products I get um, on the face as I open them. So, next up is this Ofra eyeshadow. And the shade Millennium Gold. It's pretty. Oh, it's a good size too. It's a big size actually. So yeah, let me see. To go with that is this brush, a uh, tapered blending brush. Of course, I'm not gonna use it for that shadow, but I can use it as I'm doing it. So it's a blending brush. Feels real soft, nice. And then I also got this Pacifica Coconut Blush, Coconut Infused Blush for beautiful cheeks. This is a big one. Oh, and it has a mirror on the back too. Let's see if it smells like coconut. So. Mm -mm. It doesn't smell like coconut, it smells like chemicals. And I'm not sure which one's the blush. Are there both blushes? I don't know, I feel like they're a little too dark for my taste, but I'll still try it. Yeah, it's two shades of um, blushes. Last but not least, I got a perfume. Juliet has a gun. Oh, that's a big sample. <laughs> I thought it was gonna be like those little Sephora samples. It actually smells nice. Cool. Alright, so I'm gonna do a little uh, testing of the eyeshadow and the blush and then the brush and I'll be right back. So I just used the eyeshadow from Ofra and yeah, you can definitely tell a difference um, on this eye. I just Put, packed it on on this side. I use some spray to slide a setting spray to get the eyeshadow wet and it does definitely make a big difference if you use if you use it dry or wet so I like it better wet. So that was my finishing look with the eyeshadow. I really like it. I mean it's not super bright but it's not dull enough. If you use um, like Fix Plus or something um, it'll bring out a nice a shine to it so I like it. Now I'm gonna try the blush out. I'm not quite sure what shade this one is, but I'm using the like the orange shade to it. So I said the blush, I really like it. It's not too like orangey or nothing. It's good enough. Um, I like blends. I don't know, but I don't know how to explain. But I like it. I really like it. The only bad thing about it, it has a lot of kickback, like a lot of um, fallout. If you, um, you just gotta lightly put your brush in there because it comes up really a lot. So I'm done with my face. I'm just gonna use this um, perfume on me real quick. Mm. I like it. So that's all of my products. Uh, the only product I didn't use was this one because um, I straighten my hair and I don't want to um, risk ruining it, ruining it or anything. So yeah, but everything else I used. And yeah, so that was all I got for my Ipsy this month. And I really, I, it was a pretty good bag for first time coming back for, for a few months. I think I missed out on three months, but it was a good one this time. All right, so um, I hope you liked the video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you aren't already, and I'll see you on my next video. Bye.